how to delete the temporary files in Windows 11. So hey guys, in this video I am going to show you how you can delete or uninstall the temporary files which is present in your Windows 11. So especially in the case where your storage is running low and you need some extra bits of the memory so that you can use your computer freely and without having any interruptions about the space or regarding low storage. So it is also helpful especially if your computer is dealing with slow with slow speed or slow processes. So let us dig into the process and see how we can clear or delete the unwanted files from our Windows 11 system. So the first thing that we need to do is head on to the settings of our Windows computer. To do this drag your cursor towards the bottom of your screen and you will access the taskbar. Now in, now in the taskbar you need to right click onto this start button at the bottom. Once you will do this you can see the settings option. So simply click onto the settings and you will be landed onto the settings of your Windows computer. Now the next thing we need to do is click onto this system tab on the left hand side of this page. Once you will do this you can see these following options. Now one such option is storage. This includes the storage space, drives and configuration rules. So simply click onto the storage option and here you can see a brief layout about the storage that is being used and it also gives you an idea about the installed apps temporary files, videos and other files which have taken the following space listed on the right hand side. And as for the temporary files, you can see that in my case, they comprise of about 34.6 gigabytes. So in order to clear the storage, what you can do is click onto these temporary files and you will be landed onto this page. Now do make sure the temporary files also comprises of the recycle bin files that you have deleted and also those files that are currently in the downloads folder. So I do not recommend you to clearing out or delete your downloads folder as it might have some important information that you want as well or even the recycle bin as that will be automatically deleted after some time of deleting of the original file. But what you can actually delete are these temporary files and some other files like the, the Windows Update Log files, Windows Update Cleanup if you want. Also there are some thumbnails of your pictures, videos and documents so that they can be displayed quickly when you open a folder. So if you are really in need of some storage you can delete them as well. Then there are some delivery optimization files to download updates from Microsoft and then there are Microsoft Defender antivirus files and these are as it says they are non-critical files used by microsoft defender antivirus so if you also want then you can also let them go and there are some temporary internet files directx shader cache so if you are playing any games or if you play some heavy games which requires the DirectX shaders then you might not consider deleting these and then there are also some windows error reports and feedback diagnostics. So then once you have decided which files you want to get rid of the next thing you need to do is click onto this remove files button after selecting all the check marks. So for example let's say I want to delete these files so after the selection I need to click onto this remove files button and it will give me a confirmation whether I wanted to delete them or not and it says that selected files and their data will be permanently deleted. So in order to proceed simply click onto this continue button and here you can see that these files are being deleted and once that will be deleted I will have my storage back. So let us wait for the same. So once the process will be completed, I can claim my storage that I will receive after deleting all of these files and that's how you can clear the temporary files in your Windows 11 computer. So that's all for this video. If this video was any helpful to you, do consider giving it a like. Do tell us in the comment if you have any suggestions or questions to ask and also don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel for more such exciting content and knowledgeable videos. Thanks for watching and have a nice day.